Good day everyone, my name is Makari and welcome to a game called Exposure. This game was made for the Asylum Jam on Game Jolt and I think it's going to be a fair bit of fun. Supposedly it's a spooky horror game. Shouldn't take too long, but you're basically looking at things through the viewfinder of a video camera, uh, which seems to have the quality of something from the 1990s. But nonetheless, we're going to get and see what this game has to offer us. So, let's have a look, shall we? My new apartment I have barely started to unpack. And apparently there is a door that is still locked, but the key should be around here somewhere. Alright, let's see what we have to offer then. So, we need to find a key. We need to find a key. Hello? My god, this... It, it almost looks for it like I'm looking for a fisheye lens, if you've done those. Are. It's like so disjointing with the way the um, camera is. Can I... Look in any of these boxes, maybe? Okay, so... Oh, what's that? Is that a... Is that a cayenne? No, that, that's a sink. Can I, I, there was a, um, there was a, oh, oh shit, okay. Ah, okay. So that's why it's called exposure. <laughs> oh, oh, I see what you're trying to do there. Uh, this, this is now suddenly reminding me an awful lot of, um, P, of, uh, PT, was it? Oh, uh, no, 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 not PT, um, Outlast, yes, thank you. Um, I don't, I don't know what I'm saying. Thank you. I remind, remind myself of that. This is, a, this is reminding me an awful lot of PT with the way the uh, you're looking for the guy. Aha, a key. Ooh. I got. Wait, what? Okay. Oh, I heard something. I don't much like the sound of that, but uh, nonetheless. It seems that there is a mirror missing at the table, where I found the key. Oh my. What a disaster that is. Why are we- why- I know this is a new apartment and everything, but surely there's lighting in this place. Why do we need that thing for the- whatever. Let's open. Oh. Oh, okay. I'm assuming we're gonna need this hammer to knock down this wall, maybe? Interact. Oh! Smash it! Me smash! Makari bash! Okay. Hello? There is a hidden area behind the room, but that's not possible. This floor is full of apartments. What? I like, I, I'm not too, too much a fan of being pushed back to that section every time I need to read something. It would be nice if it, nice if it just like had some wording or something. Okie dokie. Oh god. Oh no, this is terrifying. Something's gonna spook me, I know it. Oh, please don't. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, what the fuck? What is that? Hello? What is this? Okay. I found a locked gate at the end of the hall since I broke the wall. I won't stop now. No, you damn well would, because I'm going to have to go and find out what this damn thing is. <laughs> okay, this is one of these games that does really well at setting a scene. I can tell you that much for a fact. Like, there's an air of mystery about it. I'm, and I'm liking this a lot, actually. This is, like, really funky. Oh, God. Ugh. Is that where I came from? Oh. No, don't like it. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry if any of you guys uh, have an epilepsy. That that would not be the best. Wait, how do I? Okay, so maybe need to go here. Oh god, that's really disjointing. Ugh. What the fuck did that do? The gate is now open. Aha! Excellent. I shall go towards it in a merry adventure then. God, this is really surreal. That, lot, that, that camera that was really disjointing though. Oh! 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 Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! What the fuck? Oh! Oh! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck are you? Go on! 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 Oh sh! Oh! 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 Shitty balls! Ah! Oh what the hell? What? What happened? What happened? Oh! 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 Shit! 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 Is that me? Hi. Hi. Uh, bye. Uh, okay, go, 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 go through the gate, go through the gate, go through the gate, go through the gate, go through the 
something okay so that was it um that was a really short uh, little horror game and honestly i i quite liked it i mean it <laughs> okay it, it suffers from some really typical tropes of being an indie horror game it's obviously that it was made by a very short a very small amount of people and in a very short space of time but it's amazing to see what these indie games can come up with in such short spaces of time with the few resources that they have like I would love to see that sort of thing expanded on a little bit. Like, the idea of going in there and having your reflection being what's chasing you is a really nice idea. Um, I think that for the what it is, it's, an, it's a really nice little game. And I'm going to leave a link down to it into the description if you guys want to check it out at all. Um, but it's, it's one of those games that, for what was there, it set a great pace. It set a great atmosphere. And that's something that can really define an, in, uh, a game... For, there's even an indie game that makes it better than maybe a AAA game. If you can, like, there are so many AAA games out there that try so hard with the graphics and whatnot that they they forget what horror is and it's meant to be atmospheric. It's meant to be gritty and getting you feeling as if you're part of it. And I really felt as though, for at least for the majority of the first half of that, that I was in this like really creepy world where the mystery was bander and all that. But I think because it was so short, it was kind of hard to. It was kind of hard to get fully immersed into it, and I think that's the only part it really falls down on. It would have been nice to have had it just a bit longer, if that makes sense. But I thought that was pretty cool. So, I uh, that, that's all I've got time for, guys. If you've enjoyed this episode, leave a like, share, and a subscribe, and I will see all of you top hatters in the next episode. Alright. This is one of the things that stuck out to me in this game. It's just so gorgeous. I, I, I know this is one of the things that people love, when they find a gorgeous